Right, yo. There was a, a break there. Uh, I, uh, you know, got quick loot. Oh, yes. So we're going to be testing that out. And hopefully it doesn't crash the bajillion times. I also installed a I mod. So hopefully... There's another bounty if you're here to work. Everyone... About it. Hopefully everyone's uh, eyes doesn't uh, look weird. So you mentioned you were from Mississippi, right? What's it like there? It's hot and humid as fuck, and the mosquitoes will literally eat your ass alive. I grew up on a farm, herding Brahmin and other livestock. Some of the places are still irradiated, but it's mostly cleared up. The Gulf's a rough region, but people get by. It would take an act of God to tame that place. I doubt even Caesar and his crazies could manage it. Anyway, quit distracting me. Are you ready to work? I am ready. All right. The target is Billy Bogan, a recently escaped convict from the NCR Correctional Facility. He was on death row for the murder of an NCR Ranger, Captain Gunn. Young Billy was headed for the gallows, but now he's running free, much to the chagrin of the NCR. Seeing as to how they're stretched thin, the NCR's relying on you to see that Billy doesn't escape justice. Our informant said that Billy's formed a new gang composed of ex-cons, raiders, and various misfits, and apparently, they're armed to the teeth. Billy and his gang are headed north, likely to raid in lawless regions. I'm betting they're camped outside the Northern Passage. Get up there and bag that punk. Good luck. Alrighty, let's do this. Ah, Betsy. Alright, so he's all the way up there. So we'll go to Buck's place. I think I'll uh, switch back to my 10 millimeter. So it's there. Betsy is waiting outside of Randall's, so I gotta remember that. Oh, sprint is that one, right? Yeah. Alrighty, oh, I think we're almost there. I need to find a sniper of some sort. Uh, the gun runners might have something. Crouch button. There we go. Oh, because it's dark, that lights up. May need a bit more powerful. Yeah, this. Where are they? They're over there. I can't see them. There's no cover over here. Billy Bogan. Go on, Willie, keep shooting him. There we go. You have insulted my honor, and for that, you must die. Come on. Come on.
Ah, oh, quick loot. It's like the best thing ever invented, that's what it is. Now, I think I need to nick those dudes. I need to, yeah. I don't think I can loot like a uh, quick. Can I quick loot him now? No. I think it's like if it's quest people, I can't use them. Is there still one more? Get some aid in moon. Hey there. Did you take care of Billy and his gang? I sure did. Yes. You're kicking ass out there, kid. At this rate, I'm gonna be out of wow. contract soon. But don't worry, there's plenty of work left. Come back when you're ready. Uh we're gonna take a break from uh bounties now, and we are going to do another quest. I was thinking we are going to do I am the message because uh, I have never actually done that mo uh, the mod uh, this quest I would like to know what happens in it come on Betsy don't lose my shit again and uh, I think it might be a good one so uh, who knows So let's find out. I have no idea what's it from. Um, straight in here. You can run faster with two hands. With your two-handed weapon hostile, it one-handed. Oh. I was reading that game. You that I Howdy stranger. Howdy. I have a letter for you. Oh thanks. What the hell is this? You have a death wish or something? Uh, what do you mean? I'm going to make you pay for this. Wait, all the people you killed. What is this? Who the hell are you? Hey, uh, you know I think I'll just kill you. Wait. I don't know what this is. What was in there? Wait. I don't... I didn't know what was in there. So why are you giving me? Who the hell sent it? A trader named Paul Innes... In Innes? Sent it. He said it was from your cousin. I don't have a cousin and I never heard of Paul guy either. I don't know what this is at all. Well, okay. I've got a lot of enemies, I bet there's one of them trying to mess with my head or something. Sorry, I got you caught up. So what now? I don't plan on doing anything, whatever this is about. I don't want any part of it. If you really care, maybe you should... Ah, uh, look, I'm sorry, I overreacted a bit there. Normally I watch simple. Never mind. Just thought... Hey. Hey. Why are you... Douchebag Paul. How did I know that was gonna get me killed or something? But I guess. You look around a bit, but it appears Paul Everest has vanished without a trace. Perhaps you'll come across him again during your adventures. God damn it, whenever I. Oh, I leveled up. That's good. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> um. Well, we won't be doing that quest then. No, I don't do that. Um, that's... Oh, come on! Uh, crazed inventor. What about Wrangler? Um. What is love? You believe you have experienced that you can equate to humans called love. That's me. Uh, you've been touched by the move criminal. 
tech was it? He was sent form, uh, formative years, launched over events. Um, I don't fancy wearing power armor. We got good for toughness. Why not? Bit more tough. All right, we'll we'll uh, <laughs> we'll do another quest then. What was it for Betsy? Ring a ding ding. I should really do that. Keep your eyes on the prize. Neptune Town Hall. Ring for Ranger Ghost. Midnight Special. Let's do that inheritance. Taking the bait. That'll be a very long quest. That will be, and it'll probably be riddled with glitches and stuff. But But it is a good quest, and I do enjoy it. Right, we are here now, and we are going to talk to Bradley. Oh, look at that lovely sir. Hello, Brad. Look, I'm on duty. If you've got something to say, make it quick. Duty. Mm -hmm. I've been delivery. I have a. I've, uh, I've got a delivery for you. What? Are you sure it's for me? All right. Give me a second. Hold on. I thought I heard something. Fuck! Fiends from the west. That probably missed. Come over here. Need to crouch. Nice shot, Willie. Get a distant range weapon. That's, that's probably why I run out of ammo so quickly because I don't actually use proper guns that I should use. Suck on this. Fuck. There's a fuckload inbound from the west. Use cover and make your shots count. Get covered. Oh, okay. You have insulted my honor, and for that, you must die. Got him. God damn! I haven't seen that many raiders since I guarded a caravan passing through 80s territory. You're a courier, right? After that little fracas, color me impressed. You moved like a merc. Glad you were here. Since we got a little breathing room, I'd like to check out that package. A sealed letter. Let's see what it says. <clears throat> Dear Brackers, I'm almost certain you've never heard of me. No shit. When I wrote this letter, I was unsure if I'd summon the nerve to send it. Okay. I made choices long ago that impacted you more than you may know. I often question my decisions, how things turned out. We'll get to the point. Alright, give me a second. I need to heal myself before I keel over. I am your father. I separated with your mother not long after you were born. The reasons for my decision are complicated. It was not for lack of feeling or to shirk responsibility. <laughs> Bull fucking shit. On the contrary, I became an exile to ensure your safety. Not long after I met your mother, there was a war, and I was on the losing side. Mere association with me could be mistaken for complicity. 
As a result, I cut all ties with your mother. She went to Reno, and I wandered. I've no doubt Ugh. you harbor resentment for my actions. Fuck you. If you hate me or only wish to ignore me, I only beg you to accept my parting gift. Consider it my feeble attempt to reckon for your abandonment. I know you have subsisted as a soldier of fortune for some time. I never wanted that life for you. Better than your life, cocksucker. <laughs> There's a vault in the Mojave that contains enough wealth to let you start anew. You could leave the hazards of the frontier behind you. There is nothing I can offer to make up for the pain I inflicted on you and your mother, but I still owe you this birthright. It is all that I have left. Make no mistake, this is not a simple salvage. You must walk a dangerous path to collect the means to access the vault. However, I believe your profession has given you the skills and necessary fortitude to see this through. Enclosed with this letter is a key. The first of three required to open the vault. The next key is in the Linus Caverns in the Mesquite Mountains. It's been so long since these measures were put in place, I have no idea what you'll find there aside from the next key. I understand if you wish to dispose of this note and erase any notion of connection to me, you would be more than justified. Consider this my last will and testament. Your father, Joe Sellers. No bullshit. Is this some kind of con? Come clean or I'll butt stroke your fucking skull. But what? Uh, uh, um, I just deliver the goods. I'm not privy to a what's inside. Excuse my skepticism, but what the fuck am I supposed to make of this? Some old coot writes me, says I inherited his stash. Even if it's a con, it's shit. He expects me to go digging through fuck knows what kind of shitholes to get some keys. Fuck that noise. Excuse that motorbike in the background. Uh, this man could be very, uh, very well be your father. Don't you think you should at least look? Let's get something real clear. I don't have a father. Let's say, however unlikely it may be, that this old fuck knocked up my mom back in 41. Blowing your wad and walking away doesn't make you a father. Oh, yeah. This cocksucker had some nerve if he thinks he can just pay me off. Him and his long john silver bullshit give me a fucking treasure map to fuck all. To hell <laughs> with that. To hell with him. Uh, if you're not interested, I'll be happy to take the key off your hands. No, no, no. I know better than that. I don't have any illusions of some Sierra Madre treasure buried in the desert, but there could be something. If he's what I think he is, ex-enclave, that could be worth my time. Those old bastards still have munitions dumps scattered around. A lot of pre-war tech sells for a mean price out here. Fucking Van Graffs gouge the shit out of everyone. It'd be fun to undercut them. I'm not opposed to investigating this, and I'd be willing to split some of the goods if you help out. Seems you know how to handle yourself. Only thing is that I'm under contract to West Side, and as you just saw, there's something of a fiend problem. I don't know where they get the manpower, but fiends keep coming out of the woodwork to attack West Side. Even though badass bounty hunters killed some of their ringleaders, it seems someone else is stepping in to stir them into a frenzy. Rumor has it some strung-out witch doctor has the fiends on a drug-fueled holy ward against Westside. Really, I, I couldn't make this up. It seems he's holed up in the old Hoffman mine just west of here. If you can take him out, the fiend attacks should taper off. If the fiends are neutralized, I should be clear of my duties here at least long enough to track down the vault. I have to stand watch, but I'll throw in some caps if you take care of this for me. Afterward, we can strike off together. Deal? Uh, hell yes. Good. Here's a few things I was holding on to. They should help you clear those fuckers out. Just check back with me when it's done. Ah, oh, sweet. Betsy, it's time to fill you up with items. I don't think I have that. Just to get a bit of weight off to me, off me to be honest. Missionaries. Rock a wrench, I'll keep. I think uh, that'll be it. Let me just check I didn't get rid of my weapons. 